All right, uh, here I'm talking about the MATLAB 2011 uh, A Secrets. Uh, put on a presentation on December 12th at uh, a local meetup here in Toronto, Canada. Um, this is just a re recording of it on my actual desktop. So um, I just wanted to give you uh, a brief uh, rundown of this same uh, presentation. Uh, the meetup uh, is presented or uh, sponsored by. Uh, website uh, quantlabs.net which is my own site um, just a basic uh, you're already a member of the uh, premium uh, monthly service so you know all about that um, the whole idea of the uh, website is just to help traders um, researchers and analysts optimize their trading decisions by uh, us giving them uh, financial models and a variety of different for, uh, resources uh, to help them out and achieve that so today we're going to be talking about um, our chosen technologies here at uh, Mat, uh, at uh, Quant Labs. Uh, the two primary technologies we use are uh, MATLAB as well as C++. Uh, tip typically with MATLAB, um, MATLAB is the uh, investment community's number one commercial statistical tool for uh, financial research prototyping. Uh, for those that are fairly new to it, it does have excellent um, resources. Uh, including online demos, documentation, and uh, community support. Uh, enables you to get up quickly uh, to learn and to become a fairly experienced user fairly quickly as compared to something like R or uh, Mathematica, let's say. Um, for those that uh, can't really afford MATLAB, um, there are some open source clones out there. Uh, one's called uh, Octave, another one's called uh, Scilab. Um, but do understand that they are not extensible, meaning that the, a lot of the toolkits and toolboxes I'll be showing you today are probably not compatible with Octave. Um, also, our second chosen technology is C++. Um, pretty well, it's a primary development language for implementing uh, recoded models and strategies. Um, it's commonly used in uh, trading platforms as well. From a lot of the job searches I've seen, it's the number one requested uh, skill set that you need uh, to get in the world of quant trading. Um, also C++ is probably the fastest possible programming language is, is uh, close to the target uh, operating system. Um, a good instance of that is where uh, there's no uh, garbage collection as in Java. Also C++ is very portable across various uh, operating systems. Um, today this uh, demo I'm doing today uh, is I'm not really here to teach you uh, anything in MATLAB, C++, or C Sharp. Um, but uh, today we will be talking about the Coder Toolbox, um, as well as doing a demo of a simple Hello World script, uh, which will convert the MATLAB M files to uh, C++. Also, <coughs> I'll be showing you how to import the Hello World converted project for MATLAB into Visual Studio C++ uh, Express, and use it in a C Sharp uh, client application. Um, so there'll be a quick highlight use within uh, Visual C++. Uh, do understand when I say Visual Studio, I do use the Express uh, editions of C Sharp and C++. And also I am using uh, Visual Studio 2010. Also, we'll be doing a very brief discussion of one of the best uh, open source trading platforms out there, which is built in C Sharp. Um, I am going to be working on a, uh, on a uh, platform in C Sharp. Uh, which means uh, I'll be discussing some of the uh, technologies or components for that platform. Uh, also, um, th I'll be showing off or demonstrating some abilities to import uh, MATLAB, uh, using MATLAB, importing Yahoo Finance data, as well as um, exporting MATLAB data into a uh, MySQL database, all with from within MATLAB. So let's get to it. Um, just so anybody who's new to the membership uh, service, um, there's a variety of different resources that we do have available. Um, you can obviously freeze this at any time. So uh, there's our YouTube channel uh, of Quant Labs. Uh, we also provide numerous coding samples and over 600 research white papers uh, at our labs uh, section of the site, as well as we have a blog section which is uh, daily updated. Um, we also have our private uh, opt-in email list, has over a thousand plus people, um, as well as uh, we have a LinkedIn group as well, um, which includes um, some, uh, some uh, job postings, uh, as well as we do have a Toronto-based uh, meetup group that meets regularly. 
Um, and as I said, we've already done this presentation to that group on uh, December 12th in 2011. So let's get into the MATLAB Coder Toolbox. Um, I've done a variety of, uh, of uh, YouTube videos on this, um, but just to reiterate this in one small uh, video, I guess, and to actually see live demos of it. Um, uh, before the Coder Toolbox, which was introduced in 2011A, um, there was something called the MATLAB Builder JA Toolbox, which was used for uh, um, extending out uh, MATLAB M files uh, through Java or a .NET assembler uh, assembly, um, but it, it never generated real native code, and it was done through some form of compiled MEX file. Um, also, the new uh, MATLAB Coder Toolbox works as I said as of 11, 2011A. Uh, it's also the most expensive toolbox which is uh, at $6,000. Um, basically what the coder does, it just basically converts um, MATLAB M files uh, and scripts, uh, namely if you have a model or algorithm, and then it will convert it into uh, native C or C++. One of the big benefits of using the coder, it just enables you to have a coder or a team of coders that have to manually uh, recode uh, everything from MATLAB to C++ so that you can um, drop it back into your uh, trading platform. So let's do our 